In this lesson, we do some work on giving directions. Now, this arrow is pointing forwards or up. What about this arrow? We could say that it's pointing backwards or down. This arrow is pointing to the right, and of course, the opposite of right is if it's pointing to the left. Example one We've got a grid with a green counter. And we're asked, where does the green counter finish? So we've got some directions to follow. It's going to finish either A, B, C, D, E, F, or G. It's going to finish in one of those spots. So that's the starting point. First direction we're given, two spaces up. One, two. Then three spaces to the right. One, two, three. Then three spaces up. One, two, three. Then two spaces to the left. One, two. And finally, one space up. There we go. So the counter has finished at point D. Terrific. Example two. Where does the beetle finish? Hmm. These are the directions. Okay, a few more directions. And the beetle is actually facing a direction. Okay, so let's see a little bit different here. A, B, C, D, E, F, or G. It's going to finish on one of those. So starting there, forward three spaces. One, two, three. And then the beetle turns right. Okay, watch the beetle turn right. There we go. Next, forward two spaces. One, two. Then the beetle is going to turn left. Pretty smart beetle. Watch the beetle turn left. Okay, there it is. Then the beetle's going forward one space. The beetle is to turn left again. Watch carefully. Then forward four spaces. One, two, three, four. Then the beetle turns to the right. Watch carefully. Finally, forward two spaces. One, two. So the beetle finishes at the point C. Excellent.